Uh, good morning, Glue Troopers. I'm doing this quick one on my phone because I'm still here uh, waiting for the computer to arrive. And uh, I have got to, uh, of course, stay glued to the window. I did sneak out to the Tarvis and get the other side of the Felix stove painted. And as much as I marked off and double-checked uh, the striping. I actually found a mistake on some of the striping this morning before I painted the underside, so I fixed that, and it just got me wondering, what are the miscalculations did I make on my taping off of that razzle-dazzle pattern? So I guess we'll see when we pull the mask. And as soon as, of course, as you guys know, as soon as the computer shows up, I will be spending all day getting that set up, so I don't expect to get a lot done. But I will try to get a video out tonight at least showing the unmasking, how the uh, model looks. And of course, it won't be till unmask. I can see what kind of touch-ups I have to do. Also, Bruce sent me an interesting article. We were all talking about why Wingnut Wings got out of the business. And it turns out that, and I had read a little bit about some of this before, because uh, Sir Peter Jackson only makes excellent models of World War I aircraft. He also makes had a company that made real ones, or replicas. And I mean replica replicas, not... 75% scale or metal frames. I mean, he made them like the originals. I think even Kermit Weeks here in Florida has one or two of them. But that turned into a big scandal. And uh, Bruce sent me this Vanity Fair article. I think you guys will enjoy reading, which gets into that. And it would explain why Wingnut Wings got out of the business when the business is picking up because of the current world situation. So I suspect uh, that may have what is in this very interesting article may have something to do with that. And there you go. Also, uh, speaking of Sir Peter Jackson's airplanes, I had mentioned when the Red Baron got shot down the first time, he was attacking a gun bus that had guns all over it facing different directions, and the gunner had to stand up to shoot sometimes, and found this picture of one of his airplanes. This isn't the, the same type that the Red Baron was attacking, I don't believe, but it does show this similar gun arrangement. I thought you guys might enjoy seeing that. So, uh, well... When you complain about your job, remember there are worse jobs in the world. Well, that's all I've got for right now, guys. I uh, just wanted to put something out, and hopefully I'll have something to show this evening. You guys take care and model on.